Today we're going to talk about how to install your crampon compatible stomper plates onto a ski boot. This will also work with hard boots, snowboard boots, and with semi-automatic crampons on uh, regular snowboard boots. So you're going to need your plates, your crampons, and your boots. I highly recommend doing this in your living room before you try and do it on the mountains. You'll probably need to adjust the length of your crampons, which usually requires a screwdriver. And it's no fun to be sitting on the apron of a coolar that you're trying to boot pack doing that while your friends wait in the wind howls. So do this at home first, please. So what you're going to do, is you're gonna take your ski boot. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that your ski boot buckles and walk mode are all where you want them for climbing the coolar because once you've got it set up, it can be kind of a pain to change them. So I've got it in walk mode. I've got the buckles at attention I like. Usually this boot would be on, but it's harder to show you that way. So the first thing you're going to do is slip the toe of your boot into the toe bail of the crampon like you usually would. It's nothing out of the ordinary. But you don't do anything with the heel yet. Instead, you'll take the plate and you'll jam it art side down as far up to that toe bail as you can. You can see the toe bail is resting in this little notch in the plate and that will keep it secure. You want the toe bail up against the plate. Then in the heel, line up the heel like you regularly would. And this is where if you didn't adjust the plate, you're gonna have a bad time, or adjust your crampon. And then center it in this notch and tighten the heel like you usually would. Try not to get the straps tangled like I just did. Boom, you're locked on just like you regularly would. This crampon is, or this plate and crampon are not going anywhere. Make sure you might need to adjust this heel section of your crampon or the length. On these crampons, it was just this heel screw. But make sure you've got that adjusted for your crampons before you leave your house. Don't try and do that in the mountains or in the parking lot. Your friends will hit you. Then you just strap on the crampon like usual. Go climb a mountain. Um, when it comes time to take off the crampon and plate combo, remember this plate doesn't have any reason to stay with you. It would rather be at the bottom of whatever hill you're on. So keep hold of it while you're taking it off. Same thing with keeping hold of your crampon. Slip them both off. There's your boot. Click into your skis. Make sure your tech fittings don't have any ice in them. Go ski some pow. That's how you install the crampon compatible stomper plate.